Hey guys, it's Mike here from Chaos Bushcraft Down Under. Today I thought I'd do a short, sharp video um, on the Apple uh, lighting cable, yeah, as they call it. Yeah. Now, uh, I've been getting into grips with this Apple phone for a couple of weeks now, after a bit of a bad start. Now, the thing I found awkward about it, I mean, I have my iPhone 7 Plus in this other case, so getting the cable in is a little bit awkward. And uh, I've got a magnetic one on order, so it's going to make it a bit easier. But my main gripe is all my PowerPoints in my house are mounted on the skirting boards, so they're down low. So at the moment, I'm just going to have this on the bedside table charging at night. I pull out the cable, and it's gone. So that means I have to uh, get on my hands and knees and, and and retrieve it from behind the uh, the bed post. So that's a real pain. I mean, I've been using a bulldog clip, which is not that really elegant, and probably doesn't do the cable any good. So what I came up with is this idea. I've tied a, a monkey fist around a plastic bead, and it's not very heavy, but it's just heavy enough so that it doesn't leap from the bedside table. And... Uh, So when I unplug this fella, it stays. So the, the center of the monkey's fist is a, just a plastic bead. It came off a, uh, a Charles Fascinator from a pram. Now the, the plug itself across here measures eight millimeters. So I drilled a nine millimeter hole. And then I tied my monkey fist loosely around it. So the cable is still nice and free. So I didn't want to pinch this cable, unless they seem to be very fragile fellas. And it just gives it enough mass as it stays in place. So anyway, I think it's quite a good simple fix and it looks quite cool. And that's handy if you're in a shared workspace when people seem to find it claiming your cable is theirs. And uh, I'm quite pleased with it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now.